Hey everybody, it's Ed Conarchy. Happy holidays from Ed Conarchy and Team Conarchy here at Cherry Creek Mortgage. Hope everybody's enjoyed this year. It's been an exciting year in the mortgage industry and a challenging year. We've made a lot of changes, that's for sure. But I wanted to make sure I brought you this last message before Christmas. Got my Christmas sweater on here. It's snowing outside, so it's a perfect setting. But I wanted to, in this Conarchy's Corner, do two things. One, at the end, I'm going to give you a, a gift. A, $29 value gift of mine to get out to everybody uh, that's watching this Counter Keys Corner or forward this on to anyone you know um, because it's an important uh, way of me paying it forward and giving that gift out to you as well as I want to give you some tips financial and beneficial to you so let's start with the tips first um, what I wanted to do is grab a hold of Kiplinger Tax Letter now this is a resource that I read it comes out bi-weekly. I'm passionate to make sure I'm always on the cutting edge of what's going on in the tax world out there. And Kiplinger Tax Letter came out with a couple of tips that I want to make sure that I carry forward to you as my gift. One of the two gifts today is my gift to you so that you have it in front of you and you can take full advantage of it before the year's over. And here's, I'm going to read it, so if I look down, I apologize. But here's what they say. Check your flexible spending balance accounts. So if you have a flexible account, a flexible spending account with your employer where you're able to set aside tax-free monies to pay for things like child or dependent care or medical expenses that aren't covered by insurance, you want to check that account right now before the year's up because you must clean it out before December 31st if your employer still has not adopted the two and a half month grace period that the IRS now permits. Otherwise, any money left in your flexible expense, expense account will be forfeited if you don't use it before December 31st. So it's a really important thing. I've already done this exercise, made sure all the money that my wife and I put aside was completely spent so we didn't lose any of it. So that's tip number one. Tip number two, mail checks for deductible items before the year end to ensure a 2009 write-off. You get to claim the deduction this year even if your checks do not clear until January. And make sure that you know the rules if you're charging those deductions on a credit card. For charges that you make with the use of a retail store credit card, you are allowed to claim the deduction for the item only in the tax year in which you actually pay that bill. Secondly, for transactions that are made with bank credit cards, you take the deduction in the tax year that you charge the goods even though you pay the bill in the next year. So really there's a big difference between a standard bank credit card that you're accustomed to and a retail credit card that you may use for a store purchase. And then finally, their final suggestion of the year is to have a happy holiday season because it won't be long before items for income tax forms and 1099s start piling up in your mailbox. So enjoy this time with friends and family. Obviously, it's a very special time of the year to reflect and see how fortunate we are on the year. It's been a volatile one in both the mortgage market as well as the financial markets. Uh, but we've seen things ease, some of that fear go away. The Armageddon that everyone was predicting in March has obviously calmed down. And we're looking forward to a very prosperous 2010 and the economy starting to turn it around the corner here. The biggest and the last thing will be to get unemployment under control. And obviously, anyone that's experiencing it this time of the year. If you're unemployed and you're looking for work, our prayers are with you that you find that obviously sooner, much sooner than later, as well as anyone that's serving our country that today is not at home with their family, but across the seas fighting this, the war for our country, that our prayers are with you and Godspeed as well. And then lastly, my gift to you, and, and a, lot of, a lot of you have taken me up on this offer over the year, but if you haven't, this is the time to do it. I believe and I'm very passionate about this, that the most important thing that you do is handle your money financially, not emotionally. Don't do the things that are emotionally satisfying. You have to do the things that are financially rewarding with your money. And I'm very passionate about the subject. I've talked a lot about it over the year. If you don't know, many of you do know this, but if you don't know, not only have I been doing mortgages for 19 years, but for the last year and a half, I've got my Series 65 FINRA Investment Advisor License so that I can talk to clients holistically about all their financial needs, their retirement, their investment needs, college planning, getting out of debt, saving money so you have a liquid resource, a rainy day fund. So I'm really passionate. So if you ever have not just a mortgage question, but a money question, call me. I'd be happy to free of charge 
to give you advice. Independent, objective, and in your best interest advice. And with this passion comes how do you handle all your money, especially your mortgage. And one of the things that I've been so passionate about, I'm going to grab one here to, to show you, is this DVD, if you can see it. It's called the 10 Great Reasons to Carry a Big Long-Term Mortgage. This is put out by Independent Advisor. In fact, this advisor, Rick Edelman, was just named the number one independent financial advisor in the whole country. And this DVD retails for $29. I'm so passionate about this DVD that I'm giving it away to you for free because I think you need to hear the message that's on this DVD. It has changed my life. It's changed everyone that I've come in contact with and watching this. Now this goes against the emotional heartstrings of trying to just get rid of your mortgage and become debt free. But as I am focused on and I want to make sure that everyone else is, is I'm not here to teach you how to become debt free. I'm much more focused on how to become wealthy. So make sure that you take me up on this offer. All you simply have to do is reply to this email by saying free DVD and I will get that DVD right off in the mail to you right away. So very, very important for you to take me up on this offer, reply back, just simply put in the subject line free DVD and we'll mail this copy out to you right away. If we have your address, we'll mail it to you. If you don't, simply include your mailing address with it and we'll get it out to you. So that's my tips to you for the year. That's my free gift to you for the year. Thank you for being such a valued client throughout the year. And if you need me for anything, not just mortgages, but any financial tips, call us, email us for no charge. I'd be happy to give you the advice you need so you're doing the right things with your money financially, not just emotionally. Merry Christmas. Happy Hanukkah. Happy Kwanzaa. Happy New Year to everyone. And we'll see you soon next year.